random things that I don't need. Uh. Outfit check. Wake up, honey, I made you breakfast Fresh coffee and bagels too A new day is waiting for us We got lots of fun stuff to do Let's go to the zoo and feed the monkeys I can lend them your baseball cap Let's make the day a bear and our fun Growing up is just a trap We just got home from dinner I'm actually kind of sweaty right now because we walked so much. After dinner, we walked from the restaurant, which was in Fitzroy, to the city and then could have tram from the city back home. I think in total, we walked about an hour, which is crazy because it didn't feel like an hour. And we haven't been on a date night where it's just the two of us for a while. So it was a really good night. And now I'm gonna go shower and go to bed. Good night. So, at the start of the month, I told myself that I'm not gonna do any non essential shopping for November unless it's a really good Black Friday sale. But, Southern Label is having a warehouse sale in Melbourne for the next three days, and I just have to check it out. So, that's what we're going to do today. The next stop is Arthur Street.
back and let me just get changed and I'm gonna show you guys what I got. This is the only thing that I got from the warehouse sale today so I'm pretty happy about that. I didn't spend too much money. To be honest, the warehouse sale weren't as good as I thought as in the prices weren't as cheap as I thought. Also, I didn't fit a lot of the things that I liked. But yeah, pretty happy about this purchase. <laughs> it's so nice to be back in my PJs. It's way too cold outside. It feels like full winter this week. Sam has recently introduced me to Frico Camp, which is like an online boot camp that teach beginners how to code. Prior to this, I have no knowledge whatsoever in programming and coding, and I've made a couple of things. This is the website I made with cats. I also made a cafe menu. I made this. You just follow an instruction, check your code, and then if your code is correct, you just move on to the next step. And once you finish all this, you can get a certificate. I think it's been about a week or a week and a half, and I'm about 20% through the first course, so yeah. Good morning! I'm about to head out into the city to just do some shopping. I'm gonna go back to Brisbane in two weeks to visit some of my friends and it's so exciting because I haven't been back in Brisbane for a year and a half now. I'm gonna go get some gifts and hopefully there are some good stuff and I'll show you guys what I get. finished jarring and got ready because not gonna lie my hair was pretty gross and we're going out tonight to see the harry potter play is it a play or a musical i don't even know sam joined this draw to get discounted tickets and we got two tickets for 40 dollars. i think they were originally for 95 yeah I have this problem where every time, well not every time, but a lot of the times I go shopping for gifts, I end up buying things for myself or like just buy random things that I don't need and that is exactly what happened today. This is the Coco Black chocolates. It just comes like this. There's six of them inside. It's super cute. And I also got this paper filter stand looks like this nothing special but I think it would look really nice for storage from the same brand I also got this aqua culture vase this is definitely an impulse purchase. So, this alone can just be used like a normal vase, but when you put this on top, it's supposed to be like this. There is a little hole in the middle. I think this is really creative and cute, so. Next, I got this Muji toiletry case. It doesn't look that big, but it's actually pretty spacious and I think it will fit everything that I need. I also got 
some coffee beans from Bench Coffee. Never tried this before, so I'll let you guys know if it's good. And now I'm gonna go get dressed for tonight. I'm not really feeling this one. I kind of like this by itself without the jacket. Let me try with a leather jacket. Is this better? We're getting there. I paired it with a mini skirt instead. Mm -hmm. I kind of like this. This? But I feel like a businesswoman. Uh. I don't know, is this too much? The leather jacket, mini skirt, and the boots. Hmm. I think I finally made up my mind. I'm gonna go with these loafers instead. Apparently the city is really busy right now, so we're gonna head in early. And this is our ticket. I just want to jump on here and say that I was so impressed with the play. It was a play, not a musical. It was just so well thought out how they transition from scene to scene. The settings for each scene were really clear and how they made the magic look so real was just incredible. And I never actually read the book of Harry Potter and the Cursed Child, but the storyline was really good in my opinion. Highly recommend. Anyways, I've got to go to bed. I can barely open my eyes. Good night. <laughs>